It's gonna be a busy week. Does it go ready? Well, I'm not a little bit shady. Well, we don't cry. <laughs> What's going on, people? You have the lovely Vera. I really like this fit. It's so cute. Nike, wanna check it? I don't wanna do that. Crap, what am I wearing? Hello, my beautiful people. I thought I would start another week in my life, weekly vlog. Today is Sunday. I was gonna say morning. It's a lie, it's not even morning. It's like, it's 12.34. It's not morning anymore. I have a jam-packed week, so I thought, let me vlog it for you guys because it'd be like a really nice thing to look back on as well. So, going back home today, usually most sun like most Sundays I go back home, but I'm going home for a specific reason today because I need to film some content and I'm using my beautiful mama as a model. So, I need to do that. Then I'm also hopefully gonna get my nails done because it is the week of Eid and I really wanted to just like look cute for the week. Ideally, I would get my lashes done as well, but <laughs> my bank account's like, <laughs> you're funny. So, gonna get my nails done, just do like French tip on my natural nails. Then, hopefully, gonna get some henna done on Wednesday um, by a lovely girl that I met at work. Hope then, Thursday, I'm supposed to be doing a night um, upcycle workshop with a few other sewers that I've met over the past couple of years, so hopefully that should be fun. And then I'm also supposed to be going to a barbecue slash, like, hosting dinner with some of my friends for Eid. So yeah, this week is a bit crazy, but hopefully it should be good. I need to get up and get ready to go back home. I woke up with a banging headache, so yeah, I wasn't really eager to go back home, but um, it needs to be done. My hair is almost finished. Almost, almost. I think it didn't help that I was up all night editing my hair talks video, which hopefully you guys should have seen by now. But if you haven't, after watching this vlog, go and check that out. I'll leave it down below in the description for you guys. But uh, yeah, it's time to get ready and start my day. Kid Chronicles part two. You can see her shin in the background over there. Today's outfit of the day. This fluffy hat I got from a charity shop when I was visiting my nan. It was like two pound plus with it. Trench, thrifted, got it from Cancer Research. I'm wearing the same like um, jersey t-shirt that I was wearing in my last vlog. I'm obsessed with these. And then I have these thrifted like dad jean mum jeans on then i have my high top converses this bag is thrifted that's my fit of the day i'm gonna go now Guys, I'm home now. I'm best believe I'm eating some food. I don't know. Food just be hitting different when you eat it from home. I'm gonna eat this quick. Export my hair talks video that needs to go up today, and then I'm gonna do the content with my mom. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat this. So, guys, this is what I've been doing for the last how many hours? Mm -hmm. Couple of hours. It's the wide Oh my lordy, yes. lordy! How many? How long have we been doing it? I'm doing it. Yeah. We're gonna go eat. Yeah. This okay. is what I normally hold it with because I, fi I find it holds better. Oh, all day. the actual clips. Then when I'm at work, I just turn it round like yeah. this and I can tie my hair and put my scarf up. Oh. So okay, that's what I normally you. do. So I don't want to lose this because I'm going back to work. Ah. Okay. So, thank you very much, Doctor. You're welcome, Mama. Yeah. Thank you. What is it? Tell Mama and Dad. Oh, that's so nice. 
Oh, where'd you get a bell from? I got it on Etsy. Two more. Oh, well, we don't cry. <laughs> so sweet. So nice. It's a lovely card. Oh, it's so lovely. Thanks, <laughs> well. It was great. Late at night, he's coming home. Meet him at the club with nothing on. Take him out of hand, let him know what's up. If you understand me, you're my boy. Why you Hello, my. Whoa, you guys are wonky. Let's <laughs> start again. But I'm having a so echoey right now. It's late, so I'm not trying to shout. But um, it's 12.17. Ooh! Hi, guys. Hello, my beautiful people. I feel like I haven't really vlogged much today. I literally just got home and I was doing my mum's hair half the day. Um, it was for the content for a brand to um showcase one of the like blow up brushes and i was supposed to do it on my hair that was the plan because obviously i took my hair out and um usually I blow up my hair to put in braids but i didn't get the brush in time so i was like i need someone else to do this one so i was like mama what are you doing today are you busy can i do your hair i need you as a model so that's what i did and then somehow i ended up braiding her hair but that wasn't the plan i was just supposed to use the blow up brush to demonstrate what it's like on type for hair or just for hair in general but as usual i didn't come back home empty-handed mumsy always comes with the goodies you know and when i gave my mom i think the last footage you guys just saw was me giving my mom her anniversary card that i showed you guys in last week's vlog and she cried my mom cries at everything but i know that's going to be me too because i i'd be crying at everything but anyway she gave me oh my god so much stuff. She gave me a little free thing. I love my mom so much. I swear to God, like I love her. I love my parents. They're just cute. She gave me. See, I didn't even see her put all this stuff in my bag. She gave me plotting. You, you guys you don't understand how hard it is to get plot in in central london like it's actually disgusting this has turned into a food hall Google noodles i'm gonna be having this for lunch i stole some of her jars because i bought some because i bought some organic sea marks and anyway, yeah you're supposed to soak it and then once you soak it for like two days you're supposed to blend it and then keep it in a jar and then keep it in a, a dry place no I just keep it in the fridge sorry um but I didn't have any jars to put it in that were like big enough so she gave me some of the jars from home and then, oh, and she also made me cake she made me chocolate cake guys you remember last week's vlog she made carrot cake she made me a whole cake this time do you see that it's chocolate oh some alfaro yogurts I feel like this is a whole food shop. <laughs> We've got some chicken and veg in there. Some um, brioche buns to go with my jackfruit because there's jackfruit in here. And we've got a curry, a chickpea. It's, no, a pumpkin curry, I think. I can't remember what curry she said this was, but I'm just seeing. Oh, and some like um, tomato and cucumber to go with the curry. And that was my food haul. Thank you, Mama. I love you forever. Um, I'm going to go put this all away. Maybe snack on a few things because I'm going to start fasting again for the week because my period is over. Guys, please tell me why I was filming in 4K. Okay? Anyway, um, yeah. Gonna put this food away. <sighs> get ready for work tomorrow because I've watched more. I'm gonna try and get my nails done before work and then, yeah, go to work. Then try and edit some of this vlog so I don't have Sunday jam packed. We're just trying to edit everything all at once. So, yeah, gonna do that. Okay.
Love you guys. Morning guys, it's Monday. I am gonna do a quick laundry wash before I have to go to work. I've been lying in bed for the last maybe two hours. I really should just go up and start doing stuff, but it is what it is. At some point, I'm gonna have to go to a fabric store and get some, get like a neck curtain because look at this guys. So I have these huge ass windows, but I can't have the blinds up because um, everybody in the street can see down into my place. So I really wanna get some really pretty neck curtains to go down to the floor. That way I can always have the blinds up, but they're still like coming through the window. This is still the setup that me and Grace left from when I was doing my hair. So yeah, we love to see it. But um, I need to get some stuff done. I think I'm gonna save some time because I'm not eating because I'm fasting for the rest of this week. So I'm gonna get my nails done. Oh, that's it, I need to message the nail, my nail tech. Okay, back in a second. I'm home from work. Um, just chowing down on some food. I got my, <coughs> I got my dates. <laughs> I had to break my fast at work, but I didn't really bring any food with me because all my food was at home. So I got my nails there. Pretty, just basic French tip. I got it done at Nails Inc. Asked for the Keisha. She's so lovely. She did them so nice. She was, had attention to detail, which I really, really appreciate. She didn't rush. Obviously, it's just my nails and it's just um, gel. But anyway, I'm going to eat because, work again, because I have work again tomorrow. And then I need to alter one of my friend's pair of trousers because she gave them to me. And so I would alter it for her. I'm going to chill, eat, relax because the next couple of days are going to be busy. Also, side note, my flipping my charger for my um my charger for my batteries for this camera have broken. It broke in my bag. Can you hear this rattling? So another thing I'm gonna have to add to my birthday list for someone to buy me because I'm not getting a new one myself. No. But anyway, I'ma eat. Don't know why I'm talking about that. Bye. Hola guys. I feel like I'm just forever in this spot. I promise you by the end of this vlog, I'm gonna be somewhere else. But anyway, it's Tuesday, another day, another dollar. I've just spent the morning editing. By the way, sorry if you can hear banging and construction because they be doing some serious construction outside my window. Every morning, every morning they be waking me up. If you guys are following me on Instagram, you've been seeing my stories of me complaining of the construction first thing in the morning, but it's been forcing me to get up. But anyway, I've edited the first half of this vlog, which I'm really, really happy about. I've been so productive. And then I also applied for a studio assistant slash production assistant sewing job um, for a brand called Offcuts. I've been following them for a while and I really like her brand and she posted that she needs someone. So I thought that would be perfect for me. So I've just been doing that. So I uploaded my portfolio and my CV. And then I've just been editing the vlog, so now I'm just going to get ready for work. Let me show you guys what it looks like. First half of the vlog, which you guys probably have seen already. And then this is my sewing portfolio that I did on um, Canva. I was trying to do one on Adobe, but you have to pay for that. And um, it also includes video, which I did like, but right now this is just like the easiest thing for me. And I don't really know how to construct a proper actual portfolio. So I'm not gonna lie, I've just been winging it. Um, I need to add some more things, but right now, this is the basis of it. Obviously a lot of it is upcycling, so yeah. So I did that. So yeah, I'm just gonna get dressed, ready for work. I'm doing a closing shift, yay. So I don't finish till 10. Um, 
and then yeah we can finally start the week after today because i don't have work for the rest of the week which i'm so excited about but yeah outfit of the day for work Woo. this top i actually bought on shift i had to run to mns and buy me a top because i decided to come in this big ass jumper and i was overheating so i was like i'm gonna be back so i went mns and bought this top then i got my black my mirror is filthy i got my black um uh parachute cargo pants one i literally live in these and then got the crocs on my feet obviously you can't wear my crocs to work i should actually get a black pair but um yeah i'm gonna just wear my converse to work yeah guys, that's my fit. You can hear the construction men banging away. Yeah, there they are, right on cue. But uh, wish me luck. Let's pray this, this shift goes very, very quickly. Okay. I'm gonna come back and just speak it into existence, otherwise I won't do it. I need to come. So, so. I need to come back and finish my hair. I'm determined to finish it. Every time I have free time, I have to do something. So I'm doing it tonight because I'm busy tomorrow. Okay, I've told you guys and I'm telling myself. Is it 12.20 or 12.21 now? 12.21. How did, how did we get here so quickly? As you guys just saw, I've just eaten. This is the first time I felt stuffed from eating after fasting. Usually I eat and I'm still so hungry, but maybe because I had basically two jackfruit burgers, which is really good with the avo and the plantain and, you know, um, busy day tomorrow friends gonna come over i'm gonna do a little consultation brainstorm ideas because they want me to do some rework slash upcycling for them they have their own brand and they have like dead stock and i've worked with them before like a couple last year or the year before and i vlogged that but i vlogged it over on my on my vlogging channel i never showed you guys but i think there's like a video of like me doing a patchwork tote bag video that it that was for them so um I'm going to try and vlog that, whatever we can get. Then I'm going to go home, get my henna done with my cousin Khadija. And then we go on Thursday to the night workshop. So it's going to be a busy week. <sighs> I don't think I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I can do this. But I need to go to sleep. I'm so tired. I know I told you guys this morning that I was going to do my hair. If I stay up, I'm not, I'm not waking up tomorrow. It's not. And he's got to be here for 12. And I need to tidy up here because it looks an absolute sight. You guys can't see it now, but uh, So I'm going to go to sleep and I'll see you guys in the morning. I love you all.
Peace out. Morning, you guys. I be looking a hot mess right now because I literally just finished cleaning my place. Um, Chan is coming. That is my friend that I was talking about yesterday to drop off the stuff that he wants me to rework. I finally just finished cleaning my place. It actually looks like a human lives here now because the way there was just stuff everywhere. Let me show you guys. Obviously, I haven't really properly moved in because I've only been here a month, but I'm very happy with her. My shoes are literally everywhere. We got shoes here, shoes here. The bed is made. There was just stuff everywhere. But I need to quickly jump in the shower because I look like this and he's coming in literally 30 minutes. So I'll see you guys in a sec. Okay. Also, look at my little desk set up. I'm very proud of this. It's so cute. Okay. I need to stop. Like, oh, love it. Guys, this is my outfit of the day. I swear to God, I've been living in this t-shirt. I need to get like a good couple of so I can have them on rotation. Um, I have this grey cardi on that I got from TK Maxx. I want to get these in more colours too because I literally live in these. My Vintage Levi's and my Crocs. Chan's not here yet, so I'm just going to do some work on my laptop um, before he comes. And then, um, hello, are you going to focus? Thank you. Yeah, I'm going to do some work on my laptop, and then when he comes, we can start the brainstorming, you know. The construction men are still going. We love that. Guys, Chan just texted me and said he went to the wrong location. So, I've just sent him my live location. So hopefully he will be here. But um, yeah, that gives me a little bit more time to do some stuff. Tell the people that you are. This is Chad. <laughs> He's too tall. <laughs> He's a giant. What's going on, people? I'm Chad. This is Chad. You with the lovely Vera. You know what I'm saying? We did Here's some. We did some rework. She did it for us last time. Insert a clip. <laughs> I think I still got to finish. I still got to finish. Yeah. So. <laughs> I like the black side more, I can't lie. That's my favorite huh? side. The black side is my favorite side on that it's one. Like, yeah. Wow, well, all of it. Yeah. <laughs> so, we got another event coming up next week, Friday. So, she can do some reworks. We're going to raffle them away again. Mm hmm. Um, yeah, appreciate it, man. No problem. Basically, it's not even as. Would you have time? That's what I'm thinking. Like, and then what did you want this to be? We were just saying, you could just do another tote bag, but if, if you want to do something. With the other grey. So you did it last time. Those were the ideas of me. I can't believe he's actually been in the same class. No, he's dead. He's trying to take the stuff. I really am. He's like, I'm fine. He's like, I'm fine. Nah, I don't think he even made it that far. <laughs> oh, he, he, was saying, he was saying, like, yeah, it came when it started getting a bit harder. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys, so Chan has just left now. I just did a quick outfit change because I'm going to head to my house now and go meet my cousin Khadija because like I said, I'm going to go and get my henna done on my hands. Um, my hoodie is um, from Qualio. It's, that's the name of the brand and it just says, oh, can you guys see that? It just says virus and inshallah. And I love it and I'm obsessed with it. Still have my same jeans on. I'm gonna show you guys in the mirror. I don't know why I'm showing you guys here. But yeah, I'm gonna I just threw my laptop in my bag. Get my tail easy, and then I'm just gonna wear my very good new jacket over the top and maybe some sunglasses because I see sun and I'm getting gassed. So yeah. So guys, this is the fit. I switched out my glasses for these. I'm actually obsessed with them. Why won't you focus on me? Thank you. Um, jacket is vintage thrifted two two three years ago um Levi jeans and then I got my gazelles on today I really wanted to wear some color I really like this fit it's so cute got the little tail easy 
for this just to go back to my mum's house. But you know what? You guys know I'm extra, so. Yeah. Okay. Love you guys. I'm going to leave now. Bye. Doing my thing, going too fast Candy paint, with the windows all black Seeds, creme brulee, what they gon' say Put the top down, screaming money, anything We up till six in the morning When the sunrise, we'll be on it Boy, I got five, you know it's all live Tell me when to go, baby, when we gon' slide Baby, when we gon' slide Mumsy cooking egg yet Carrot cake, muffins? Yeah. For eat Oh nice. That one's done. If they come out nice, you'll get some. Hi. Hi. Bye. I don't care if we on a run. Nothing matters when we want on run. Looking at us cause we going down. We on the same way. You the same way. You know I'll be done if this was you. Where we going, baby? What's the move? We should take a trip up to the moon. Did you seriously meet every single time I come home? Why? Hi guys, I'm home. Got my henna done. Uh, look at her. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys properly. Let me put my bag down, shall we? Every time I go home, I end up coming back to my place at like 12 or 1 in the morning. It's 12.43. Anywho, I'm gonna be quick because I shall now be at the night workshop in the morning and I'm trying not to shout because my roommates will probably hear me. Um, you guys are wonky, why are you always wonky? I'm just coming on to show you the henna. This is the henna that Hasana did. She did it beautifully. I feel like I'm a beauty influencer. Would you look up, can you look, can you see it? Can you see it? Yeah. Um, if you see like sticky things, it's because she sprayed it with lemon and sugar and apparently that's what makes it stick so it doesn't rub off and i didn't know this but um you learn something new every day so i've been trying my hardest not to wash my hands because obviously water makes it um water makes it come off quicker so i'm gonna try and make it last till tomorrow but i'm gonna have to have a shower so i don't know how i'm going to do this without getting this wet but anyway i'm going to go to bed because we gotta be up in the morning. Crap, what am I wearing? Okay, I'm gonna go do that. Oh, also, side note, I just told my Insta story, but I wanna tell you guys too. Um, I had a really funny story on the train, so I was on my way home on the train, and I was on the platform waiting for my train. This guy came on the platform in a hoodie, on his phone, da -da -da, whatever, and I could just feel him staring at me, but I was like, don't, don't make eye contact because he's gonna come up to you otherwise. So I didn't. The train finally comes, he sits in the same carriage as me and I could feel him staring at me. And I was like, just don't look at him, then he won't talk to you. And then he gets off at his stop. And before he gets off at his stop, he stops. He's like, sorry, he's like, he's still on the phone at this point. And he's like, wait, wait bro, wait, one minute, one minute. He's like, and he comes off the phone. And he's like, excuse me, sorry. I wanted to talk to you earlier, um, but I saw this on your finger. So I just left you alone. But I just want to say you're really beautiful. And I was like, dang. So then he just carried on back on the phone and proceeded on his way. I said, A, hey, all because I left this ring on my finger. Guys, I just wear this for fashion. I always have these four, these, mainly these four rings on my finger. Um, all the time. Like I never take them off. There's usually these four. And everyone always asks me why I always keep wearing my rings on my ring finger. I just do it by habit because I just like having it there, not for any other reason. So the fact that he was staring at my hands and saw this and thought I was married, so he decided to leave me alone and not move to me was hilarious to me. But anyway, I just wanted to share that little story time. I'm going to sleep now. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the morning. Not me sitting here edited at what is it, 10 in the morning, and I get an email for my work. So basically, the company I work for right now have been wanting to change positions for a while, and I want to be videographer, because as you guys can tell, I really like editing, and doing Photoshop and all that stuff, and like, I'm just really creative that way. So I've been wanting a job like this for ages, and they've literally just emailed me this morning, 
and they were like, hi Sabira, I hope you're well. The team would like to fast track your application for, since you've been working for the company for some time. However, they would like you to complete a task as it is part of your application process. So they've just sent me a brief and I have to do it by Monday. And today is Thursday. So I'm going to probably read this when I come back from the Nike workshop. But right now I need to get ready to leave because I have to be in Tottenham Spurs Stadium for two o'clock and I'm still sitting here editing this week's vlog. Oh, yeah, I'm so excited. This is such good news. I'm so happy about this. Sorry that it's dark. Why keep my brightness keep changing? God, was that dark the whole time? I'm so sorry if it was, but you get the gist. Okay, let's get ready. door it's half 12 and i just want to give myself enough time to get there this is the fit of the day did a cute little face beat nothing amazing i haven't put makeup on in so long it feels so cute to put some makeup on but anyway bodysuit i got from primark this hoodie is from a brand called good for nothing I'm wearing my black i literally just cleaned this mirror how's it already dirty anyway i'm wearing my black um cargoes parachute pants. I got these from Amazon and then I'm wearing my Nike TNs on the feet because we have to wear either plain black shoes or night shoes and these are the only night trainers that are, in, that are all black. So this, my camera autofocus is absolutely terrible but I'm gonna leave now. Yes, so we can get there one time. I'll see you guys when I get there. <laughs> Level two? The Nike event. Yes. The lift? Yeah, there's a lift right there. Okay. Let's take the pull up. Alright, thank you. Danny! <laughs> <laughs> Do you need help prepping? What are we prepping? Yeah, just find a chair. And then on this side, we've got a other one as well. We've got Kenzie. Not the TV and the toilets. Mm. Hi guys. So I left my camera out in the front, but I've just got here now. We're just prepping. We're making tote bags. So we're just prepping everything really quick. The event starts at four, so we've still got some time. So Danny and some of the other guys are gonna eat something. Obviously I'm fasting, so I can't eat. So I'm just gonna be chilling on the sidelines. Um, I wish I bought my laptop now, I could have, Done some editing, but that's long. So um, yeah, I'm in the toilets. Use some Q and A toilets. Yeah. Not, not okay. Danny stuff in her face. Some food. <laughs> Does anyone want any? Okay. Look and have some. No. <laughs> you, you. <laughs> if you want, you. <laughs> you eat it. Oh no, seriously. My favorite person to see is <laughs> Skater Boy. Everyone calls him the Skater Boy now. And he bought his skates. I didn't even bring mine. I, didn't, I, know, I, didn't. I was good. 
like for then I was like, if he leaves it, but I was like, he skates everywhere. So I don't I know. Do. I, he skates everywhere. You knew what it was when you signed up. I know, I know. But we're gonna fish at nine. Where are we skating at nine? Outside. Are you gonna get <laughs> and, um... <laughs> I'm screaming, not that's a ragged. It's <laughs> see through because of security, that's why. He came prepare her. <laughs> Your scissors, I need to get scissors like this. I have my other ones, but they're so dull now. Was it? Shout out to Taylor. Oh yeah, I follow her. I follow her. <laughs> all right, let's go with some work. <laughs> it's good to have you all here. So today, we are celebrating Earth Day. You know, it's about protecting the planet and obviously using previously owned items and to reuse them again. So this tracksuit that I'm wearing right now from Nike is made from all different recycled materials, which is very cool, right? And so today we are gonna have you all getting involved in some upcycling. Looking forward to it? Hi guys, so we're just on a break now. Um, the first batch of kids have come. We've made their stuff for them. It is now 5.55. We have the next session at 6, at 6.40. Um, it finishes at nine, so we've literally just been like banging out <laughs> tote bags for the most of the afternoon. But yeah, it's been really fun so far. I just, oh, this is so much fun. I want to do this like every day. The team is so lovely. We all get to work together. The kids were lovely. They're so polite. Um, and we were just like chatting to them, talking to them, explaining to them what upcycling is. I would have a break and eat something, but I can't. So I'm just going to chill here on my phone for a bit, reply to some emails. And then I guess once I can break my fast, I can eat something i probably will be like mid sewing once i can eat something but it is what it is so um yeah i'll talk to you guys in a bit when we're finished <laughs> <laughs> this is danny hi guys tell the people then what you do hi i'm danny i'm a master up cycler mm -hmm. and i'm a sustainable um can't think of you yeah, yeah. Yes. well sometimes I say sustainable influencer, content creator, yeah. anyway all that good stuff. Mm -hmm. um, I got two kids, I'm single, <laughs> if you're over six foot and ready to mingle, six foot three would be age, over 40. Age. I'm like 45, like mature. Oh, okay, no, wait, wait, hang on. Okay. For, 41 <laughs> and older. Um, I don't yeah. mind if you've got kids as long as you're a good dad. Mm. And... Oh, and I upcycle clothes. I'm really good at it. Thanks. <laughs> Please. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna go do some work now. Guys, I can finally break my fast. Not me eating popcorn, but I don't have anything else right now. All I got is popcorn and some fruit juice. Just gonna eat that bit because I haven't got anything else right now. This is um antibacterial spray. You trying to boil it? It's quite handy. Look who decided to join me. Come back. <laughs> Come back right now. <laughs> I have lost track of what he's eating today. <laughs> that is mad. He can eat. Look at him. <laughs> you enjoying the popcorn? Enjoy it. Not really. I want it to be salty, but. So that'd be. Oh, let's go flippers. Flippers when we have Roller Nation right around the corner. But you have. I don't want to go there. Guess this. I don't have my skates. Look who bought his skates! When I tell you this boy goes nowhere without these, this is his transportation. Oh, they're my blueberry yum yums. No, yeah. Y'all be skating the fine. Get it! Danny, when was the last time you skated? When was the last time you skated? Mr. Lover, that girl is. Look at this creaky shape. I. I did it was. Oh, okay. Oh. oh. I don't want to skate, like, this is so sore. You said you were going to go home. No, that's like in here. Oh, I say, don't, don't you dare say you're going to go, because no. No, we're not doing that. I just hear the music and my feet can't stop dancing. Because you really said five, six, six, seven. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. Yeah, I was watching. And I I had you had the speaker, oh, right? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Be good. Like, careful, please be careful. Be careful. Oh, yeah, careful. look. Careful, careful. Be careful. Yeah, till they get you, to kick you out. <laughs> have you got, have you got insurance for those? You got a license. I mean, Sam. look, I'm rapping the brand, right? <laughs> Nike, <laughs> where to check it? Yeah, you are. Yeah, he's got powers on. Samira, did you, you have the last time I skated? Yeah. yeah. Flippers last year, isn't it? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Why are you being shady for? It was, wasn't it? That was shady. No, it wasn't. Like that was super shady. No, it wasn't. No, no. like it felt. Like, it felt 
felt cold. There was well, a, there was a dash of. It was genuine. It felt, was it nice? No, it was nice to her. Guys, was it a little? Just you know when it's like. Oh, there was a little bit of a breeze just there. <gasps> That's how shady it felt. felt oh, just a tad. Like a shudder. Yeah. Intentionally. Sorry. So, um, the answer? Is the, Danny the answer? I mean... <laughs> <laughs> so he was right. He was right. Guys. I'm home. I'm finally home. It's so late. It's 11.05. I've been home for about an hour. The event finished at nine. It's been a long day. It was so fun, but it's been such a long day. I'm just gonna sign out and say bye. I feel like this vlog is so long already, but I have one more thing to do this week. I got some more good news on the job front, as well as what I told you guys this morning with the job I'm at now. So yeah, things are really looking up for me, which I'm really, really happy about because I have been stressing a lot when it comes to work and stuff. And yeah, actually making a living from what I love to do. But I feel like all in God's timing. Where am I going with this? Yeah, I randomly booked a nature walk, foraging walk. I followed this guy called the Electric. Yeah, I followed this guy on Instagram called the Electric Tribe. I'll leave it here to show you guys. Um, and he like basically promotes like the alkaline diet. I've been like basically trying to figure out um, like health wise what is the best diet for me. And right now I feel like I'm all up in the air with everything other than obviously not eating red meat and pork. But um yeah i saw him post it and the ticket was like 10 pounds i was like why not i really want to try it and it'd be cool just to be in the environment with like earthy signs i feel like i'm so in I'm, i feel like i'm really showing my earth sign with going to this on top of the fact that it's earth day when they do it but anyway i'm saying that all to say i have that to do and i kind of want to vlog that because it would be kind of cool and something different to do in london and then i'm possibly going to a barbecue slash eat dinner but i don't know if i'm gonna have a chance to do that because i have so much stuff to do <laughs> my brain is scrambled but yeah if you guys are still watching now appreciate you guys so much love you you're clearly enjoying the vlog so i appreciate that i hope my edits are good because i do like to put some good edits in but um yeah i'm just gonna go to sleep and let my brain just rest because right now it's on a thousand so yeah, and I gotta take my makeup off. <laughs> I don't wanna do that. <laughs> okay, love you guys. Good morning, my beautiful people. Another day, another outfit. Today is Saturday. As I told you guys, I've booked that walk. So today is the day we go. They changed the time on the email, so they sent us an email like two days ago saying that it starts at 10 30 instead of 11 30 so right now it's like quarter to nine so i thought i would just leave enough time to um get ready this is my fit of the day i'm wearing this satin lined beanie because um i think it's gonna rain today it's very overcast today there's no sunshine in sight and obviously we're gonna be walking around in the forest in green so yeah i just wanted to make sure I was dry because I don't have an umbrella and I'm just wearing my Tala running top. I really love this. I had this in the leggings um, but I'm just wearing the top and it has thumb holes and I'm obsessed with thumb holes. Then I'm wearing my cargo dickies that I thrifted I don't even know when and then I got my Doc Martin Jaden boots on. So this we're going to be walking around it's going to be muddy and I'm not sure whether yeah I thought this was just like the best footwear to wear because they told us in the email to wear appropriate footwear because we're going to be walking around in mud and stuff so yeah then i'm just going to have a puffer coat um, over and then i'm just going to bring a black little mini backpack but anyway i'm rambling now so let's go so we can get that on time guys you know this camera does not like to focus on me this whole time anyway bye I don't know, when I grew up, I, you kind of assume there's nothing edible around here, but it's mm -hmm. good to get an idea of what you can find in London. Once you have that knowledge, you realise yeah. that there's so much. We're actually having an abundance of wild yeah. medicinal 
edible foods yeah. around here. Always know with 100% certainty what we're foraging. There are many plants that have poisonous lookalikes, some that can kill you. I think we, we don't really think that there's plants in the UK that can kill you, but there definitely are. Um, that's not to scare you, um, but it's just so that you're aware. There are different foraging books, guides, apps as well you can get on your phone. One around. So yeah, this is Comfrey. Latin name is Sulfitum officinal. And um, in terms of its energetics, it's moistening and cooling. And when I refer to energetics, it's basically, um, in a nutshell, the effect that that plant is going to have on the tissues within the body. So, for example, ginger is a warming plant. Comfrey is um, known as a cell proliferant. So this basically means that it helps to double the rate in which our cells grow. Remember what I said about the rose family? That they have five petals. Exactly, the flowers usually have five petals. If you see that in nature, you can usually be quite sure it's part of the rosacea, the rose family. Later on in the year, they'll produce wild cherries. If it has a square cross section, you can kind of say that it's very, chances are very high it's part of the mint. Oh yeah, it looks like a mint. Hello beautiful people, I am home now. I'm just in the middle of editing this vlog that you guys are watching right now and of course i have to sign it out it is currently 10 51 this morning was so amazing so good i had so much fun i felt like a little kid again like just learning so much that i didn't have a clue about i felt like i took myself on like a mini field trip um and i met some lovely people today and it's just so nice to meet like like-minded people that was just interested in things that you are as well we followed each other on socials and yeah it was just really it was just a really nice morning i'm surprised i woke up so early but um yeah i just wanted to sign up the vlog i hope you guys enjoyed if you did please do give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below if you haven't already if you guys are new to my channel and don't forget to follow me on instagram if you aren't already is at nabila bira i'll leave it down below in the description for you guys but yeah other than that i will see you guys in my next video peace Only you want your